Hi everyone, my name's Bill and welcome to my channel. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. This video is to help T8 Pro owners to set up a Delta wing on their in their radio. And it's not it's not difficult at all because there is a wizard to be able to do this. And a Delta wing is one of these. Let me show you. For beginners that don't know what a delta wing is, it's one of these. Um, you can see we have elevons, which so they are both operate as the ailerons and the elevators. And this is a tough little model. It's a, gr it's a great little model to, to fly. And so anyway, let's uh, switch over to the T8 Pro and I'll show you how to do this. Now we need to go to our model button, move down to a spare slot. So number 14, push enter. Create, and now we're going to choose, select the Delta. Now we can default on all of this in my AERT channel mapping on my radio. So we can just go across. We haven't got a rudder on this one, so we're going to, you could have a rudder, but we haven't on like my model that I'm setting up. Then long press, and there we go. It's as simple as that. So if we go page across, we can obviously put our, change our name, which I've shown you in a previous video how to do and what I'll do now is set this up let me go to the mixes uh, come back one and you can see our mixes there on channel one and channel two for the for the uh, elevons now let's go through and we're going to push return and now if we go across we can now see there are our ailerons and there will be our elevator. Now we need to fix this up to the rig to set, see if it's working correctly for the orientation of the servos on my plane. Now let's take a look at my test rig and check if the servos are working in the correct orientation. Now if we use our ailerons you can see there's a problem there because I'm banking right so this aileron would go down and this aileron should come up and then we've also got a problem on the elevator so first thing we're going to check is the channel 2 and we're going to get the aileron to work correctly so we go to the model button we page across until we get to mixes and so we are which, that is, this one's channel 2 so we've got to adjust the aileron so we're going to go down to the aileron channel and we're going to change the weight to a minus figure. So minus 50. So there we go. So now we're correct. We've got correct uh, right bank and left bank. So we're good there. Now we can test our ele ele elevator again. So of course this one is correct. Now the other channel, which is would be channel should be channel one yes that is correct channel one is incorrect for the elevator so we are going to return and come out we're going to go to our elevator on channel one so there we need to make that a minus figure a minus weight so we're going to move down and we're going to there you go Right, now we should be good to go now. Let's have a look. Bank right, bank left, up elevator, down elevator. There we go. Now we've set it up. So you will need to look at the weight um, for your particular model because of the orientation of the way the servos are put into your model. Well, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below because I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.